What's up, YouTube? What's up? Welcome to my channel, El Comic Box. This is JoJo speaking, coming at you. Well, where to begin? Where to begin? My first comic call video. I've had this channel for a few years now. Uh, done different things. Got a lot of sketch videos. Interviewed different people. Neil Adams. It's all on my channel. You guys are more than welcome to click and watch and enjoy. Uh, well, uh, I guess this video, or these series of videos, is going to, uh, well, my purpose is a dual purpose. Uh, I've been collecting since I was nine years old. Um, back in the 80s. Mid 80s. And I've been collecting seriously for most of that time. Um, but it starts with this guy. <clears throat> My best friend. Throughout the years. In the beginning, there was and always will be Spider-Man. This one. Oh, my goodness. The Adventures. Peter Parker, the blue-collar worker of the Marvel Universe. If anybody were to ask me or who or what issues are the definitive Spider-Man. Of course, it's Amazing Fantasy and Amazing Spider-Man 1, Volume 1. All the way to 300 or 350. That's the definitive Spider-Man. Uh, yeah. Uh, friendship. <sighs> Collecting the books. Uh, but uh, I found this one a couple of weeks ago. <clears throat> of course, I've, ha I've had... I still have the ones that, uh, that I bought back in the 90s. <clears throat> when McFarlane, they gave him free reign to do this series. Spider-Man. <clears throat> and then he left afterwards maybe after the first what, 12, 13 issues beautiful artwork <clears throat> and then he went off and uh, became part of the exile and began uh, with the other image founders uh, to start Image Comics I guess you know what Image stands for right? A lot of people, a lot of people don't know about this, but Image stands stands for independently motivated artists generating excitement. Man, that was an exciting time to witness that exodus. That hey, you know what, Marvel, screw you. We're gonna do this, and they did. A little misguided though, but good. But anyway, let's start with the hall. Uh, I hope everybody got this one. Batman Beyond Rebirth. Oh, DC Comics is doing a great thing right now but with the Rebirth titles. Superman's really good. Batman's really good. Uh, and I can't wait to read this one. This one's going to be great. Uh, there's this one and then there's the... Uh, the... Uh, the... Variant, which is done by this guy that I know. His name is Carlos de Anda. Again, another... Uh, artist that I had interviewed in one of my videos and uh, he's there if you want to click there uh, what else did I get uh, I got this one Amazing Spider-Man number 94 love it it's a little beat up now nah, it's a lot beat up with the guy uh, there at the uh, the comic store he goes take it I'll give it to you for eight I said cool eight dollars hell yeah I'll take it I, think I love that cover 94 and me again, always in trouble. I think I'm going to do like a, uh, one video just showcasing at me being in trouble all the time. Always in trouble. Got that one. I got this one at another LCS. He had it for half off. Four dollars. I love it. Uh, I've, you know, I, have, I have this one too. Anyway, I was talking about my dual purpose. And I'm going to go off on tangents all the time. Dual purpose for this video. <clears throat> One, of course, to see what I have, 
but also to take an inventory of what I do have, what I, I don't remember what I have. Uh, I have short boxes in storage. Uh, I've had them for the last 10 years. But before those 10 years, they were, I had collected religiously. Uh, and they've been there 10, 15 years. And they're all in short boxes. Uh, but um, that's why I'm doing this video. To see what I have. Sometimes I, for, I forget what I have. And sometimes I'm like, what the hell did I buy this for? Anyway. So I'll be doing those. Each video I'm going to try to see if I can uh, unload or showcase a short box. Okay, so I got this one. I love this one. Uh, this is a two-parter. Uh, there's 269 and then 270 where Spider-Man kicks ass, kicks the ass of Fire Lord. Hell of a read. Hell of an adventure. Uh, then I got this one too. All-Star Batman number two. I know a lot of guys, everybody out there, they, like, they love Jock. He's an awesome artist, of course. But I love this one. Shel Shalvi. I don't, I, can't, I don't know who that artist is, but that's his name. But I love this cover. It's so awesome. I inadvertently got two of them. Uh, but I love this cover. I love it. Yeah, All-Star Batman is fantastic. <laughs> if y'all aren't reading it, uh, Batman and Two-Face. Uh, well, having an adventure. Well, he's trying to bring Two-Face to justice. You got this one too, the Harley Quinn number two, Rebirth. Harley, uh, tied up the, tied up Batman. He's got bunny ears. Fantastic. I don't know who, who drew this one, but it's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. Right. Oh, got this one too? I was surprised to find this one. Uh, Arthur Adams, awesome artist. Uh, doing, it's one of the, this is a connecting cover. Um, but I think he's doing like six issues of The Walking Dead doing the... Like this might be the first one. I'm not sure. Um, but I love the way he drew Michonne. My goodness. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. I love it. Oh, okay. Uh, what else? Ghost Rider number seven. Robbie Ray is, right? Oh. I watched that... First episode, the first two episodes of S.H.I.E.L.D., my God, fantastic, fantastic, whew, I love the way he turns into him, it's vengeance, chica, I love it, and the Charger, oh, I hope they make a Hot Wheels out of it, because I'll buy it, a small one and a big one, uh, what else, oh, barbed wire, covered by Mr. Adam Hughes, one of my favorite artists. Oh, man. That guy draws women. Oh, beautiful. So many beautiful covers that he's done. Uh, I know he's doing the Betty and Veronica comic now. Which, uh, I, I wanted to get all the covers, but the he's drawing the interiors for that one, too. I haven't read it yet. I heard mixed reviews on it. But, anyway. Adam Hughes, ladies and gentlemen. Adam Hughes. Hopefully one day I get to meet him. Hopefully one day you do a little sketch for me. Uh, I found this one in a long box. Look at that. Uh, at an at a LCS. That's uh, way across town from where I live. But uh, the comic shop that I, that, that I went to, I mean, they just uh, concentrate, or they just deal in new issues. And then the back issues that they have, back issues, quotes, back issues that they have are just like, the things that they had sold maybe like a year ago. But for some reason, this one was in there. Time and Farline, Hulk. Issue 345, look at that, that's beautiful. Awesome. The Grey Hulk. Yeah. So yeah, I couldn't leave it there. So I took it. Awesome, right? Okay, speaking of Jock, look at that. Beautiful. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. You know, I have other comics and other, other covers that he's done that I, uh, I'll, I'll showcase later. But, damn, that's awesome. Look at that. Kicking the shit out of Two-Face. Damn. But that, for the first one was awesome. Oh, I love that first cover. Anyway. Uh, what would be number three? Frank Cho? This was the issue that he, I think, 
he got pissed off at Greg Rucka uh, because he didn't want to show the rest of this part right here. <laughs> oh, but that's a beautiful cover. Frank Cho, man. Whew. Awesome artist. I don't know if you guys are picking up his new stuff. Uh, I forget what it's called. Uh, but it's, I haven't read it, but I'm, it's just fantastic. I love it. Well, we'll read it. Anyway, Wonder Woman. Frank Cho variant. Beautiful. Oh, uh, this one. Detective 940. This one is going to be a great one. Robin sacrifices himself. Uh, Batman, Bruce, tell everybody that I love him. Boom! <laughs> and then uh, he comes up again. He turns up again. What's going on? What's, what, what's up? Anyway, great read. Detective. Robin. Awesome. Okay. I'm going to go on a rant on this one. <clears throat> Hillbilly number one. Okay. Hillbilly number one. Eric Powell. The goon. Awesome. I can't wait for them to make that. There's a, a cartoon movie. You know, animated movie. That will be awesome. There's a little snippet of, of what they did. I think it was like some sort of a... Like a teaser or some sort of trailer. It's on YouTube. It's fantastic. Anyway, Hillbilly. It's this new thing. Uh, I remember uh, in Comixology, they had like a short preview. And you could download it for free. Oh, fantastic. I don't know if it's part of this one. The, of this one uh, or if it's a separate story. But anyway, I'm mad at this one. Because I totally missed the boat. I knew it was coming out. But uh, I didn't get, get, get to the comic store in time. And uh, I totally missed it. But I got number two. Number two I got. But number one, I couldn't. They were sold out everywhere. I couldn't believe it. And I just happened to go to my LCS one day and they had it there. They had it there. I go, what the hell? So I got it. I had to pay a lot for it, but I got it. Can't wait to read it. Judging by how that, that preview was, it was fantastic. Oh, man. But now I'm in the same boat with number three. Shh. I missed the boat of that one, too. So now it's going to cost me. Anyway. Hillbilly. Awesome. Uh, also from the same store, I got this one. Beautiful. 119. Amazing Spider-Man. I got it for like 10 bucks. It's a little beat up. But I love it. I'm guessing this is... I think it's the first appearance of the Hulk there on the Amazing Spider-Man, I guess. I'm not sure. But anyway, you know what happens after this, right? It's the second appearance, I guess. But after that, it's the, the beginning and the end of Gwen Stacy. 121 and 122. And I have a story on 121, which I'll share later. Anyway, isn't that great? I love that cover. Uh, another one. Got it kind of cheap, too. <laughs> X-Men. Number 82. Beautiful cover. Old school X-Men. Uh, what can I say about the X-Men? Hello. She's a little beat up, but hey, that's okay. Next. I was kind of surprised that I found this one. Check that out. The Night Nurse. <laughs> I'll do some research on that. Um, very hard to find. They only made four issues. Four issues in the series, the Night Nurse. And I think I think the Night Nurse is a. Uh, uh, she's Rosario Dawson, right, in uh, Daredevil, and Luke Cage. Oops. But anyway, I found number four. We'll be on the hunt for the next for the other three. So that's cool, right? I love it. I love the cover. I love the how they had the balloons back in the day. The word balloons, Night Nurse. Awesome. And the last one. Thor, number 207. They're kind of beat up. They gave it to me for like six bucks. <clears throat> but this one in particular is really cool because uh, I know for a very fact one Dr. Von Chilla, that's his favorite comic. <clears throat> that's his favorite comic. I don't know if you, if you guys saw some of his videos. He has one video completely dedicated to this issue. And he, and he goes through it. But he's got a bunch of and beautiful, pristine condition all of them but i saw it and go hey there we go part of the club anyway so um 
that's part of the haul. I got a lot of eBay stuff, a lot of other stuff that I've that I have that I'm going to show. I've been meaning to do this video for a while, but um, you know, waiting in the wings and seeing all these beautiful videos that you guys do. Oh, the passion you guys rekindled my passion, rekindled this affair that I have with this beautiful medium comic books that I love so much. Uh, I have so many stories that I want to share, and I hope you guys join me in this odyssey, this quest. Uh, I'm uh, quoting Dr. Von Chilla. Shout out to Dr. Von Chilla. Awesome. Uh, a lot of you guys that have inspired me. Jimmy C. Comic Book Steve. Uh, Biggest Comics. And the NY Warriors. Awesome. Uh, who else? Mercer Not. The Detroit Mad Man. Uh, all you guys. Awesome. Beautiful collections. Beautiful everything. Oh, the amazing Murphinator. I'm going to try to see if I can do a video of you guys, uh, for your, for your uh, contest, but uh, running out of time. Running out of time. Anyway, shout out. Oh, and OMG, Old Man Gamers. What's up, Chris? Love your stuff. Awesome. Anyway, you guys have a great one. This was my first video. Tune in to more. Join me on my quest, my odyssey, to see what I have in these short boxes and uh, share a few stories. Have a good time. Hang out. Keep hunting. Stay hungry. Peace.